Now presenting Dr. Di Diane of the Lobster Conservancy and her amazing lobsters. Diane Hi, Cowan. I'm Diane Cowan, and this is an extremely unusual lobster. It has three claws. I've seen many lobsters with extra appendages, but never a claw like this. This third claw has the knuckles and movable parts. It's as though it has two thumbs, or dactyls, instead of a thumb and a hand. Now, you may notice this third claw is a bit filthy. I don't know if you know, but lobsters spend a good deal of their time grooming their little legs, scrape the shell, and keep it clean. But the lobster can't reach this third claw, and so it's fouled with mussels and barnacles and algae. Poor little thing. So from time to time, I take the lobster out of its crate, where I keep it to share with the public so people can learn about it, and clean it off. Oh, by the way, this procedure doesn't hurt the lobster because its exoskeleton is dead tissue, like our fingernails and hair, and uh, so it doesn't hurt the lobster to be scraped in this way. That looks better, doesn't it? How old is this lobster? This lobster is probably seven or eight years old. It takes them on the order of a decade, ten years, seven to eleven years, to um, reach sexual maturity. And this one is not mature, which may make you wonder, well, is it a male or a female? It happens to be a male. Do you remember how to tell a male from a female? Um, uh, how you tell from a male is a female is if you take the top two uh, little legs here and you feel them, and if it's hard, and it's thick. Uh, if it's hard and thick, it's um, it's a male. If it's soft and feathery, it's a female. Let's see if we have any unusual females here today. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> here we have. Oh, and I'm dipping them in water to keep them uh, cool and moist so they uh, don't run out of oxygen. All right, now, this blue lobster happens to be a female. Because it's thin, soft, thin, and feathery right here, as you can see. Isn't she a pretty shade of blue? How rare are blues? One in a million. So, if you think about lobster landings in Maine, we have on the order of 60 to 70 million pounds caught a year. Um, I was just testing you. But this I've never seen before. I think this is one of a kind. See that? <sighs> could it feed itself with that claw? Could it feed no. that claw doing for it? No, it, it doesn't. It the claws are it used. In. Look how heavy it is. It yeah. weighs this mm. other claw down. Mm. Um, they don't. Their claws don't reach their mouth. They use their claws to capture and manipulate prey, but they feed with their legs and their and their maxillary uh, mouth. All right. These really should go back mm -hmm. in the water. Thank you, Dr. Diane. How was it?